Why, hello again, everyone. This is the Inspector Dave Fernicola back at you with another shave. And today, uh, we're going with our uh, Amazon series of creams, or creams that I bought on Amazon. And today, we're going with Alonzo's Sens Sensational Shave. It's easy for me to say. <laughs> It's another English cream, the first one being the Knightsbridge, uh, I think. Uh, the Bib and Tucker, I don't know where that's made. It could be England, but uh, I'm not quite sure on that. But anyhow, uh, the bottom line is the English make great creams. Tobbs, True Fit and Hell, it goes on, okay? Uh, so we're going to be using that today. And the... Razor, we're going with the Rex Envoy, the most excellent Rex Envoy. And it's quite a razor. And we're also going with the, the new blades we're going with is Shaver Boy out of Canada. But I believe this is Chinese made blades. So we'll give this a shot and see how it goes. I have the cream in my Captain's Choice lather bowl because I want to show you the brush. The brush is new too. Hold on. It's the Omega Evo Synthetic Italian Flag Brush. And this is quite rare because it's sold out on every almost every um, website there is right now. I was lucky to Grab one, and so we're going to be using that. So I'm going to heat it up and introduce some water and lather up our cream here. I used the cream yesterday, and it was absolutely fantastic. So, as you can see here, we need more water. So we'll add that. Now I usually don't make the cream here. I usually have it on my face already, but I wanted to show you the brush, so. We're making the cream right now. And we're getting there. Okay, I think we have a good amount of cream here on our brush, so we'll put it on our face. And this is a bergamot scent, which is absolutely lovely. Very fresh, cologne type scent. Cream goes on excellently, if that's a word, excellently. Most excellent, I should say, maybe. We'll heat up the blade and get shaving, as we say. Okay, first go around with the Shaver Boy blades. And working on one day's growth here. Don't have that much growth, guys, today. 
but we're shaving nonetheless. I think we may leave the goatee area as is today. And hit that up tomorrow, maybe. Okay, first pass done. We'll give it a quick rinse. Oh yeah. Nice brush. This looks to be about a 28 millimeter brush. And it costs, uh, oh, about 80 bucks, which is pricey, which is pricey. Okay, second pass against the grain. And this blade appears to be doing pretty well. Cream is nice also. A nice bergamot scent. By the way, this Rex Ambassador is a non-adjustable razor, 125 bucks from Razor Emporium. Knurling is second to none, it has great knurling. Great knurling. And what else do I want to tell you about it? Oh yeah, very nice by the way. On the scale of aggression, if you were to take a Rex Ambassador, which can be quite aggressive on the higher settings, uh, this is about a three on a Rex Ambassador. A three setting on a Rex Ambassador. Very nice, very nice. Okay, second pass down, we'll give it a third pass here.
This cream is, uh, well, how much do you get? Let's see, how much do you get? Uh, six ounces. Six ounces for about 15 bucks, about there. I want to say 15 bucks. Uh, maybe a little bit less. So you're looking at a uh, what, 250 an ounce or something like that? It's quite a buy. Quite a buy. Yep, so the Shaver Boy blades were about $7.95 for 200 or 100 I guess. Yeah, 100 And price was 12 bucks shipping out of Canada, so the blades were like 15 $15.95 altogether, I want to say. Okay, guys. I think that's it. We didn't have too much to take off today, but... Making an effort to uh, to shave almost every day, if not uh, every day. If you know what I mean. Guess that didn't come out right, right? Making an effort to shave every day, although sometimes it doesn't go to plan, but. to the towel here. Oh. And I think with this Alonzo's sensational shave that we went with today, uh, I believe I'm the only one that's done a YouTube video on it. I mean, there's been, they do pre-shave and shave oils. I think there's uh, videos for that, but none on the shave cream that I saw. So, rarity, I could be the first one that's done a video on it. So, uh, a great cream, a great cream. Um, this is just, what's in the brush left is just ridiculous. And we'll go, go ahead and rinse the brush well.
Okay, there it is, rinsed out. And we'll take it to the uh, towel here. Part of brush care every day, guys, that you should be doing. And as you can see, it's perfect. All right, we'll put that back in the uh, back in the stand. We'll wipe our area down and bring in the Thayer's Cucumber Witch Hazel. And we're getting a little low on it, but uh, as Chris Bailey would say, fear not because there's more coming. Yep, very good. Okay, so let's review what we've done, guys, for our soap. I know it's backwards, but I don't know how to turn this thing on so it, it reflects... Uh, um, in the opposite way. So this is Alonzo's Sensational Shave, made in England, a mighty fine cream. Like I said, I think I'm the only one that's done a video on it. So uh, if anyone looks it up, it, it'll, it'll pop me up right away. So uh, good things about that. Um, had that all lathered up in our Captain's Choice Copper Lather Bowl with you see how much lather I have left from the brush and in the bowl. And for a shaver, we went with our Rex Envoy with our, see our shaver boy blade inside. First use went very well. That's all I got for you today, guys. Thank you for joining my, in my den, the Inspector's Den. Um, hopefully be back with you tomorrow or sometime during the weekend. Uh, have a great night, and we'll see you soon. Take care, guys.